Hey YouTube, Smooth Criminal here. Got a uh, new episode of Kid Customs. My nephew spent the night with me last night, so we spent some time customizing. He's got some pretty cool stuff. So uh, I'm going to let him have the camera now, let him have the show, and he'll talk about the cars that he designed. Because he really did, he designed it. He picked it all out, I just built it. So let's let him talk. So here's Peyton. All right, YouTube, here he is. Little man Peyton, hold it on the palm in your hand so they can see what you did. Tell them about it. Let me get it closer. What is it? Tell them it's a charger. It's a Dodge Charger. Yep. What'd you put on the front? I put an engine on the front. Big gold engine? What wheels did you pick out? Big gold wheels. Yeah, he picked that out himself. The engine, the car, the wheels. Look, oh, let me show y'all what I did on, figured out on the bottom. See if I can show y'all. I used uh, the bigger, oh, it's not going to want to focus, but a bigger popsicle sticks. So I found me a new easy way of lifting these cars up. Because everybody knows I like these donks. My nephew does too, obviously. But, yeah, here it is, up close. Kick yeah. Big engine, big wheels. It's a monster. Look at that. Here you go. All right, show them the other one. This one is, a, I think, a 68 Cougar. You can't read. Stop looking at the bottom of that. But, yeah, he picked out the, the colors. I had some green. He picked out those racing wheels. Let's see if I can get close to the wheels so you can see. Eh, can't see them real good. It's not wanting to focus. They're good to your wheels. All right, be still. And um, he liked the color of it, and he wanted it green with a red stripe, so we did the red, I'll show him the top. So we did a red stripe. The paint, I, I don't understand my paint sometimes. I, I don't know if they just didn't mesh very well, but this got all swirly. We liked it, so we left it. But uh, looks pretty cool. It's like a race. It's fast on the track. You want to race it, Peyton? Show him on the track. Let's see if I can do this. Alright, let it go. That little cougar he built is fast. Alright, let me sign off here. Hey, YouTube, uh, yeah, you just saw the Kid Custom video, so got up this morning, house was cold, so turn the heat on. I forgot to turn the heat on last night when I went to bed. Anyways, so now, um, can't let Peyton steal the show. This is a smooth criminal channel. Nah, I'm proud of him, man. He's doing some cool stuff. We like some of the same stuff. He's taking after his crazy uncle, so that's cool. So yeah, I'm gonna show you some um some of my finished products that I got right finished up here lately. And um maybe a couple of works in progress. I've been forgetting to do that. That's kinda how this thing got started was I had nothing but finished product our work in progress is videos because I didn't have all my supplies, so I'm going to show you a couple of those, too. Uh, yeah, hit the like button, subscribe. I appreciate all you guys that leave comments and stuff about about this stuff. I put a lot of time in these things. It's worth every minute, but it's cool, you know, when people comment on it and let me know. All right, so, yeah, let's get the show on the road and show you what I got finished. All right, so what are we going to start with? Oh, we'll start with this uh, Cadillac. This is awesome. Man, the camera does not do this purple justice at all. But it is a beautiful color. My girlfriend picked it out a while back, and and um, I like it. But anyway, yeah, I did some grinding on this to... Um, Put the bigger wheels on it. It rolls. Yeah. Did the grinding so the bigger wheels would go on there. Painted the interior. Let's see if you can see it. Kind of like a tan color. So, what's that? I've heard a rap song Peanut Butter Inside Jelly on the Outside, something like that. So, yeah, that's my peanut butter and jelly Cadillac. Grape jelly. But, yeah, I added a little bit of detail. Wasn't a shaky, I think, uh, 
been going to the doctor to get, try to get my health all lined out, so maybe we're getting some stuff taken care of. But yeah, looks good. I like it. And what else do we got? Oh, I did a Ducati. Man, I'm proud of this thing. Stripped it down. It was the white and black. So I, just, I stripped all the paint off of it and kind of polished the the metal. There's a lot of metal on this little motorcycle. So I polished all the metal. It's purple too. The camera makes it look blue, but it's it's a brilliant purple. But um, yeah, I just I don't know all my things I want to spin, but yeah, did the just polished up the metal on it and painted the plastic parts and painted the wheels too. You can't really tell it in the camera. But yeah, that thing came out awesome. I'm going to do me a couple more of these if I can find them. Because that's just, that's cool. Alright. Got that one. Now these are some projects I've been working on for a while, a long time ago, a couple of years actually, and I fi finally took them out and finished them up. Made me a racing truck. This bottom part is from like, a, I think the Cadillac IMP, I think is what it's called. So I cut it out and cut the back of the truck up so that it would mesh together. JB welded it all together. Lost the windshield in the pro process of all this, but printed out those decals. That's an expensive part of this, buying the ink for the printer <laughs> and the paper. But man, it really is pretty cool. I mean, it makes these look pretty neat when you put all the decals on it. But yeah, put the big engine in the back of it. Yeah, it's like a racing semi. It's pretty cool though. I like it. It rolls. It took a lot of grinding and stuff to get it rolling, but man, it was worth the time I put into it because it came out pretty cool. I didn't add no details to this one. I was going to, but oh well. Smooth criminal back there in the back. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. I did another one, not as much body work, basically just put a huge spoiler on it. Bunch of decals on it, all the sponsors. Kind of cool, the base I painted red, and it came out pretty cool. Hey, where are you going backwards? Ah. It's alive. Yeah, I added detail to it. It rolls. I'm wondering how fast it is. That thing's heavy. Heavy casting. Huge spoiler. Just dropped an engine back there in the back. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's a smooth criminal racing truck. I think I'm going to try to do every kind of like racing vehicle with a <laughs> smooth criminal on there. Just because I'm crazy and maybe a little bit arrogant and vain. I don't know. And my girlfriend is a, well I am too, huge Cowboys fan. We got an important game today. So she wanted me to do her a, uh, do her a truck. So this is what she picked out. She picked out a monster truck, which I thought was awesome. But yeah, let's check that out. <laughs> it's just cool. Oh, where are you going? This isn't a freestyle show. Isn't that what they call it? Freestyle, yeah. Watch this big thing. So I'm going to jump off of there. But yeah, she wanted a um, Cowboys monster truck. And she wants me to, um, oops, uh, we'll just show it. We got Fear This on top and then a Cowboys emblem on there. 
Came out pretty cool. Looks kind of plain, but oh well, it looks good to me. I like it. I know she'll like it. But anyway, she had this idea. Let me see if I can get back here a little bit. Whoopsie. Yeah, I said whoopsie. Grown man said whoopsie. <clears throat> she had this idea of making a car and crushing it. Because she wants to put her rival team. She she doesn't like the Saints at all. <laughs> so we're going to do this right here. Crush a car and then like put the Saints emblem, you know, on the crushed car so that we can show we dominated it. But I thought that was a pretty cool idea. I didn't think she'd be she would think that this stuff was cool, but yeah, she's all into it. She's got me. She wants me to make her daughters some cars and she's already bought she's buying me some. She's coming to visit here pretty soon, so She says she already got me some hot wheels. Anyway, so we got that. Let me get this thing back on the tripod. Okay, now, you know, like a true smooth criminal fashion, let's uh show you a couple works in progress. What do we got? Oh. This. Didn't have a dump bed or front end, so I took it apart and kind of kind of rat rotted it out I think I mean it's not done I gotta do some painting and stuff on it but put that engine in the front with the, the exhaust coming out the side like that and kind of fit in there per perfect I don't have to do much well, no modifying really to the body or chassis to put that engine in there did need to do something to the front to, so I took the bottom of a car and cut it off and made me a huge cow catching grill on the front of it so that's pretty cool but uh i won't show you any of the ones that's really just paint jobs but got this did this camaro it's almost done but yeah kind of made it like a dragster put the big wheels on on there and cut a hole in the hood and poke the engine out of it looks pretty cool engine's not glued yet it's just laying in there that's why it's Crooked like that, so. Oh, well, they ran out of memory on the phone, so we'll just we'll end it there. Uh, those are some of my works in progress, but um. So yeah, this is you know gonna keep going, hopefully, you know. But yeah, that's what I've been working on. Stay tuned for some future stuff I've got working on and. Got some pretty crazy stuff coming out, I think. It's taking time to do it, but it's pretty wild. But anyways, this is Smooth Criminal signing out. Be good or be good at it.